Hi, this is Linda Wood Rondo returning to you from a long hiatus. My favorite Bible verse is off the cuff. What you see is what you get, even the mess in my bookcase behind me. The reason I've been away for so long is I have been suffering from some upper respiratory lung issues and baffling the doctors till they come up with the diagnosis, GOK, God only knows. Finally, we're getting some answers. I am getting better somewhat day by day by day, getting a little stronger. Uh, before, I couldn't even talk without uh, a half hour of coughing and um, not very pleasant, so um, I wasn't able really to continue with, with this ministry. But God is faithful, and uh, he's not done with me yet, um, and so I am able a little breathlessly, but able to come back. And I hope this series will bless your heart. Today, I wanted to talk to you about Second Peter 1, 5 through 8. But also, for this very reason, giving all diligence, add to your faith virtue, to virtue knowledge, to knowledge self-control, to self-control perseverance to perseverance, godliness, to godliness, brotherly kindness, and to brotherly kindness, love. For if these things are yours and abound, you will neither be barren nor unfruitful in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. I picked this verse today because it contains uh, the, my word, for 2023, which is perseverance. And I take this word and I write it on the top of every uh, page in my journal as I'm journaling. And uh, to remind me that God's not done with me yet. He has work that he wants to do with me. And so I persevere in my desire to be more like him and my desire to gain in this knowledge and in these virtues and in brotherly love and in kindness so that I will be fruitful for him. And I hope these words encourage you today. Persevere. Don't give up. If God hasn't given up on you, don't give up on him. Thank you for listening, and I hope you have a wonderful day.